I grew up in Zimbabwe. I remember going to RS Sports Club to watch cricket as a young boy. And uh, as an off spin, I always looked up to my head coach right now, who used to be a former cricket player, former captain for Zimbabwe, the off spinner. He used to bet as well. So uh, he's one of the guys I used to look up to. And the guys like Hamito Masakadza, Eto Chikumbura, I think those are the guys I, I grew up looking up to. And they're still my idols today. It's a good feeling to be honest. I never thought uh, something like that would happen. Because as a player, if you get an idol to work with you, uh, most of the times your game will probably go up. So I think it's, a, it's probably a win-win for me and uh, I'm grateful for that. Uh, he's a good all-round cricket. Uh, having said that, I think uh, he's also a good team player. It's up to him, to be honest, to go out there and express himself and do all for the team. It all comes with pressure, everything comes with pressure, especially if you're one of the, the leaders in the team. But I'll say if you just put yourself in a position where you're able to perform, I think all the pressure uh, sort of like goes away because if you perform as a leader, everyone is going to chip in. So at the end of the day, you just have to perform to get the pressure away from you. It comes with expectation, like you say, but I don't think he's going to do it on his own. He will need the rest of the team to, to support him in order for us to be in a good winning position. So in terms of his work ethics, uh, we obviously try and balance it out. I think he's a lot, though he's young, he's slightly experienced. I think he's starting to understand how to manage himself and I'm there also to help him out in terms of uh, managing his preparations. Under-19 World Cup, it means a lot to me because if we take a look at it, that's the platform for most of the players. Guys like Virat Kohli and them came through this tournament and being part of it, it means a lot to me as a player. I think looking from the, the World Cups that I've, I've played, we've come close at a couple of occasions and um, I'll say if we just get through the playoffs and uh, manage to, to go to the next stage, I think that would be perfect for the boys but uh, hopefully we win the World Cup. Taking a look at it, the, the World Cup has been played here in South Africa and being able to, to travel uh, so many places here in South Africa gave me an opportunity to sort of look at my game and see where I can work on. I expect us to put up a good fight. We're gonna go out there. Uh, we're going big or we're going home. That's our motto. I don't know if I'm, I'm able to predict the future, but I'll say what I want to do in the, or where I want to be in the, far, in the next five years. I think if I can be able to be in a situation where I'm able to play for my country and uh, represent my country with pride, I think that would be perfect for me. So I'll say I'm just fighting to get there uh, on, the, on the bigger stage of the international level.